COVID-19 restrictions are keeping a large portion of fans away from sporting events. So students at Liberty High School are bringing the games to them. And the program is helping prepare students for the future as well. Fox 2's Michaela McGee tells us more. The pandemic has brought its problems, but it's also brought opportunity. The Winsfield School District has started a student program that teaches them hands-on technological skills to help them through the age of COVID-19. They're learning the real world experience. Derek Dockett, the director of marketing for Wentzville School District, helped create a program allowing students to learn new professional skills while appeasing football fans at home. Since we were new, we were going to be sort of restricting the amount of people coming to our games. Uh, it gave us an idea, an opportunity to allow us to do some live video coverage for those that couldn't come. Students are learning how to stream live sporting events, implement advertisement, create graphics, and cut highlights. Jace Hahn is a sophomore at Liberty who is actively involved in the program. This is actually one of the things I want to do, uh, along with photography and film. Uh, I've always wanted to do that ever since I was a kid, so this is perfect for me. Mr. Dockett used to run the show as a one-man band, but ever since the students took over, things have taken off. They're averaging around 3,000 views per live stream. Having people join from their houses because uh, they can't come to the game it has really helped us grow. We've gained a lot of subscribers on our YouTube channel, and it's just feedback is amazing. For Jace and Mr. Dockett, this program is bigger than just streaming high school sports. Learning how to adapt and overcome challenges, as well as learn skills hands-on that will help students in their desired career field, makes it that much more valuable. Uh, we love to replicate that at our other high schools at the same time, but it's worked out great and we hope it continues to grow. Reporting from O'Fallon, Michaela McGee, Fox 2 News.